Nebraska beat Rutgers God. 14 to 13. Yeah. Y'all know? It definitely wasn't his fault. But it's like the undisciplined shit of the, of the Rutgers football team is just very surprising to me. They they had a chance to get that ball back and not not only score but score with no time left. Yes. And and I think it was on like a fourth and no it was a, it was a third and 12. Guy throws a short pass. They pick up like three yards. The guys getting ready to go out of bounds. They gonna they they stop the clock because he was getting ready to go out of bounds. So you're getting ready to stop the clock, get the ball back with like four minutes left. Still have a couple timeouts, right? I don't even know the guy's name, but he he takes the receiver and like just throws him on the ground like yeah four or five yards out of bounds. I'm like, fam, why? Yep. Why? Why you don't like winning football games? That was really Why bad. you don't like winning? What's going on? What is happening? They dominated you in the first half. Now, idiot. they didn't score enough, obviously. Mm, right, yeah. But they dominated in the first half. Punt uh, punt return, interceptions, and then turn around, or punt return, punt block and interceptions, and then turn around in the second half and look like a completely different team. Quarterbacks threw three interceptions. And that was another thing, too. So they had Vedral, who they actually, you know, that's their starter. He's, he's But he's a, injured. Yeah, His he's hand was hurt. So then they put in the backup, Simon, mm-hmm. and just about every time Simon dropped back to through, he threw it to the other damn team. Yeah. And it, it was like when they got down, down, and they had to score, they had to they had to get the guy who could actually throw the ball more than 10 yards down the field. Yeah. And he just wanted the other guys to have it more. Mm-hmm. So, I don't know, man. Uh, it, it was kind of tough for them with the quarterback situation, but they were still in position to win that game. It's kind of kind of – not great to see them lose that. But shout out to, to Mickey Joseph. I called him Tony Morrison last week for some reason. Did you? Yeah. Shout out to Missy, Mickey Joseph. That. I think yeah, that's their Mickey Joseph for sure. third win, fourth win? Third. Uh, third. Third? Three and two. Third? Okay. Yeah. All because right. they won one with Scott Frost, didn't they? Before Montana? they lost to Oklahoma. Oklahoma. Was it Montana? I can't remember. Something like that. But then they won two with, with Mickey Joseph. Mm. Um, I, it's still way too early to say that Nebraska is back. And the fact that they got dominated in that first half the way oh, they no, did. Oh, no, no, they're not back. They're breathing. They're on life support. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they're at least doing better than probably what we would have thought, but not Who by finishes much. finishes with a better record, Nebraska or Wisconsin? <sighs> Wisconsin. Think so? Wisconsin. Because as much as I am not crazy about Leonard – I think he is probably a better coach, and they have a tiny bit more talent. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think they have a Braylon Allen. Yeah. They don't have a Braylon Allen. Yeah. Them, so. That's the biggest thing. 